In this video I want to talk about weak electrolytes. So we had strong electrolytes before, now I want to focus on weak electrolytes in this video. Weak electrolytes dissociate or ionize only to a small extent in aqueous solution. If you remember when we had strong electrolytes we said those electrolytes they dissociate completely so it means that there is no original molecule remains in the solution but in weak electrolytes the story is different so we have dissociation only to a small extent so a weak electrolyte is a substance that is only partially ionized in aqueous solution a weak electrolyte has a weak or a small tendency for providing ions Weak electrolytes are substances that exhibit a small degree of ionization in water. That is, they produce relatively few ions when dissolved in water. The most common weak electrolytes are weak, weak acids and weak bases. So weak acid and weak bases. So as you see, for weak electrolytes, we have only a small electrical current. So we have the lamp lights up only dimly. So ions are present in solution, but the concentration of ions is very slow. It is very low. The solution could be a solution of a weak electrolyte or a dilute solution of a strong electrolyte. So these two cause a small current. It means that it can be a solution of, uh, of a weak electrolyte or the dilute solution of a strong electrolyte. So it means that the amount of ions in solution is very low. So weak electrolytes, for example, acetic acid is a very, very different from a strong acid because only about 1% of its molecules dissociate in aqueous solution, a typical concentration. So it means that 99% of acids remains intact. So as you see here, we have two rows. So we have acetic acid here converting proton plus the rest of it so after equilibrium this dissociation is only one percent of total amount of acetic acid solution in water so it means that after the equilibrium we have 99 percent this part and one percent this part so it means that we have very very small dissociation so acetic acid exists in water mostly as undissociated molecules. Only a small percentage of the molecule are ionized. As you see here, we have mostly acetic acid as their original molecules. So any acid such as acetic acid that dissociates or ionizes uh, only to a small, uh, slight state in aqueous solutions is called a weak acid. On the other hand, weak bases, ammonia is called a weak base and results in a weak electrolyte. So most of the molecules remain intact. 